Let's see what happens. I got stabbed. There. Once there in my arm. It's gang, gang stuff, really. Hear them guns blow in the ghetto for that big or that small dog. Life is gone. You know what I'm saying? It's gone. No, we're not gonna see you shy again. You have to understand. There's a youth lying in there that was alive like me and him. Breathing and speaking. Living. He's in there dead. Cause are we really winning? Are the kids grinning? When shots go off in a man's christening. I got stabbed on my back. I was only young as odd. I had been shot up in that, yeah. yeah. That's where it went and this way it came out. These are all my friends, you know. All my friends that's gone, you get me? Madness. Absolute madness. Like you sit here and you moan about all the people that are gone and you just think, how many more people have to go because these people have gone? There's not even 10 miles between the whole and it's both areas, you understand it? And for it to be created that for and travel in this small little space, it doesn't make no sense. If heaven was a place on earth, then I'll go, then I'll go, no matter how far. I would fill the tank in my car and I'll roll, and I'll roll. Cause where I'm from, there's a lot of sad faces. A lot of us had to live with the basics. And it's hard things that they gotta face in the places I know. I thought to myself, you see, if, it, if I don't come and do something like this, nothing will ever probably come of this. Who else can I think of that's going to come up and say, you know what, we have to stop this thing? And you'll wake up in the morning and think, I can't be living like this. It's not a joke. Wanna... Yeah, it's not. It's, you get me, you're done, you're burying your friend and you've done, you're crying, and your bridges, your mum's crying, you think, I can't be living like this, man. This is crazy. Me the boss, I paid the cost and nearly ruined my life. Wasted years in the penny, something new in my life. For all the dirt, did the shit I've been through in my life. I should be stuck in jail doing the life. You understand what I'm saying? We need to open for ourselves and do something, you understand what I'm saying? Look around, like black, we don't own nothing. We're not a threat to the government in terms of we're not going around shooting police. Does that, that make it harder for us? Whereas the government could look and think, well, um, they're not bothering us, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, I think that's probably part of the problem. Yeah, that's that's things like just hard. killing each other, why would we care? They, they would like it to stop, but they're not going to invest in it as a way of stopping. So you'll have to do it yourself. I'll be ducking and diving, bossing that hood niggas mainly. I got shot once, that's enough check for me, baby. Shining on wood, boy. No one don't want a truth. Man don't, man raw don't want a truth. Man don't mind having beef. We need to be growing young black men, not no niggas. We need to be growing young black men. This is the norm now. It's not even a bad thing to us. It's just normal. normal. It's life. See, since man I met up and that, nothing ain't really happened. Couple little minor things, but nothing on the scale of how fucking last year was, blood. We're just, we're just heat wave of shooting and that, blood. Because the next man dies now or the next shot goes up, but it's just gonna get messy again. <laughs> We're all big men. We've all lost friends to this thing. We all got brethren's in jail doing life to this thing. We no man they're still fresh. None of your friends ain't died yet. None of you ain't ended up in jail and no over no gang shit doing life. You understand it? None of you ain't sat down and thought about yo, 35 years in this cell. So in the last four days or so, how many shootings and stabbings has there been? I woke up in the morning at seven o'clock. The first thing my dad, my son said to me, was that boys got killed, my friends got killed. Yeah, my young man's arm and leg got seven, but was hanging up, so. I don't want to pull into that, so there's been a lot. I don't know how much people got shot. I've heard five, I've heard four, but I just know people got shot. Yeah, wait, no, I don't want to calm down. I'm upset. I, I'm, I'm upset like the rest of the country. If you haven't noticed, we're pissed. We are mad. So, how do you officers feel about what's going on out here? They're acting like I'm not here. And this is the problem that we have in our community. When we speak to these people, they act like we're not here. 